Fireworks have captivated audiences for centuries. Their origins can be traced back to ancient China over 2,000 years ago, with the explosive discovery of gunpowder. What started as an attempt by Chinese alchemists to create a recipe for eternal life, unexpectedly transformed into a powerful repellent used to ward off bad weather and evil spirits. Whether it be the Super Bowl, the 4th of July, or the Olympics, fireworks remain a staple for celebrations near and far. Modern fireworks are a combination of science, technology, and art. At their core, they rely on the simple process of combustion, but other factors such as the composition of the gunpowder, the shape, and size of its container, along with more advanced methods of computer automation, have made them even more spectacular, sophisticated, and controversial than ever before. One review of backyard fireworks found about 31% of them were defective, which increases the risk for injuries. Firework injuries skyrocketed last year. The majority of those injuries, of course, taking place in the time surrounding the 4th of July. Fireworks-related injuries are up 25% over the past 15 years. Last year, there were at least nine deaths and an estimated 11,500 emergency room visits. Fear-inducing statistics like these, in addition to other criticisms like noise and air pollution, disruption of wildlife, as well as agitation among those who suffer from PTSD, has resulted in a noticeable shift in sentiment towards firework shows. This has caused many people to consider substituting fireworks for less dangerous alternatives. But if not fireworks, then what could possibly replace this age-old tradition? The proposed answer to this question is like something straight out of a sci-fi movie. Just like fireworks, drones have undergone their own unique transformation over the years. Originally developed for military use in the early 1900s, drones have since evolved in a variety of interesting and unexpected ways. In fact, we are currently living through what could be described as the golden age of drone development. Advancements in the hardware, software, size, weight, and stability of these multi-rotor aircraft have allowed a number of multi-million dollar industries to reach brave new heights and profits. Drones can be used for a lot of things. Photography, videography, search and rescue, surveillance, Amazon Prime air delivery, even some forms of alternate transportation. While that's all pretty cool, it begs the question, can a pre-programmed swarm of quadcopters equipped with LED lights really succeed in captivating the minds and hearts of audiences around the world in the same way that traditional fireworks shows have for centuries? Could they even come to replace fireworks entirely? To answer these questions, we'll have to further understand how a drone light show is created. The first step in creating a drone light show is by planning and designing the show itself. This typically involves creating a storyboard timeline that outlines the different patterns and movements that the drones will make. The timing and coordination of the desired elements and effects are often planned in sync with a soundtrack, allowing the show to become a multi-sensory experience. Once this initial planning process is complete, the drones are programmed with the light show timeline using a specialized software. This programming ensures that the drones move and light up in perfect unison, creating a seamless and mesmerizing display. This software generates a 3D rendering of the entire show by calculating the flight paths of each drone to prevent mid-air collisions. This helps to reduce risk to the ground crew, the audience, and the drones themselves. However, due to a limited number of industry standard tools, companies such as Firefly and Verge Aero have opted to develop their own software to assemble their shows for their clients. Using GPS or radio technology, an entire fleet of drones is able to communicate with each other just like a swarm of bees communicates within a hive. To ensure this constant stream of uninterrupted communication, it's essential that the drones operate outside of busy Wi-Fi frequencies and noisy radio environments. Finally, it's time for the main event. On the night of the show, the drones are launched into the sky, and the light show begins. The drones fly in formation, creating intricate patterns and images with their bright LED lights. One of the biggest benefits of drone light shows is their versatility. Unlike traditional fireworks, which are somewhat limited to a set of repeated colors, sizes, and intensities, drone light shows can create a wider variety of visuals, from simple geometric shapes to complex images, animations, and even realistic portraits. This opens up a whole new world of creative possibilities for event planners and designers. While drone light shows offer several benefits over traditional fireworks, 
It's important to note that they aren't perfect. Just like any technology, they have their own unique set of limiting factors. For one, each show requires several stages of regulatory approval, must meet strict safety requirements. In addition to this, there remains a low supply of skilled workers who are able to meet the demand for such performances. More than anything though, it's just really, really expensive. Despite this high financial barrier to entry, there are those who remain happy to embrace the novelty of this new technology and choose to burn their money on expensive quadcopters instead of gunpowder. In the spirit of friendly competition, year after year nations around the globe have been pushing the boundaries of what is possible by increasing the number of drones as well as the complexity of their choreography. If you imagine each individual drone being like a pixel on a screen, and you factor in the reality that drones are getting smaller and more advanced every year, is there really a limit to what you can create? First on our list is this 1000 drone light show which broke a new Burning Man festival record. Designed by Dutch experiential artworks firm Studio Drift, the show included a three-dimensional rotating human head, a floating Burning Man replica, along with a tribute to one of the festival's founders, Larry Harvey. Apart from the stunning visuals, the fact that the show was able to go on for hours via the support of 400 Starlink terminals powered by SpaceX makes this performance even more impressive. On July 15th, 2018, Intel broke the Guinness World Record for simultaneously flying the most unmanned aerial vehicles with 2018 drones. Since then, Intel has flown over 300 shows in 16 countries, including this awe-inspiring performance, the Pyeongchang Winter Olympics opening ceremony. Their custom-built lightweight drones called Shooting Stars are equipped with a light that can create over 4 billion different color combinations. Hyundai's luxury brand Genesis Motor China set another record-breaking show with 3,281 aluminum illuminated drones on March 29, 2020. In addition to tracing its own logo and cars over the Shanghai skyline, other amazing designs achieved included an outstretched hand, a DNA sequence, and a complex set of QR codes that made this show look like something straight out of Blade Runner. One year later and the bar was raised again by the innovative tech company High Great. They secured four world records for this incredible show including the largest drone mosaic, the most UAVs airborne simultaneously, the most consecutive formations achieved by UAVs, as well as the longest animation performed by UAVs. The company has carried out over 5,000 performances in over 300 cities across the globe, including the 2022 Beijing Winter Olympics opening ceremony. Looking into the future, one of the most recent record-breaking shows was the 2023 Sheikh Zayed New Year's Festival held in Abu Dhabi. In addition to one of the most realistic drone portraits ever achieved, another world record was broken for the largest drone QR code formation, consisting of over 3,000 drones. If that wasn't enough, the show also shattered three existing fireworks world records during a staggering 40-minute long hybrid spectacle. It goes without saying that drone light shows are a promising new form of entertainment that offers many benefits over traditional fireworks. Now that being said, some of you may still be skeptical of this new technology and rightfully so. One of the biggest threats to drones in general is their ability to be hacked by an outside source. Just a few years ago, a drone light show in Hong Kong's Victoria Harbor was cancelled completely due to the drone's GPS signal being blocked. From their familiar smoky smell to their trademark explosive crackle, some critics argue that drone shows don't offer the same tangible experience that fireworks do. Either way, with the $262 million earned from public displays and $2.2 billion from consumer purchases, the American Pyrotechnics Association doesn't seem threatened by the appearance of its new digital competitors. So what do you think the future holds for drone technology? Is it worth the high price and potential risks? Should we be concerned about how small they're getting? Or should we just sit back and enjoy the show? Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. For more videos about artificial intelligence, science, and technology, subscribe to the channel. And while you're at it, watch another video here.